guys, welcome back to my channel, Chit Chat with me, Miss KMP, and today we're here with another video. I'm excited, guys, I didn't even know this was coming in today. I got a phone call from, you know, where I get my package delivered, and they said, girl, your package is here, and I'm like, ready? Because usually, you know, shop is, you know, connected with my Jeffrey stuff, and they usually tell me when my packages are here. Girl, so this was like a surprise. As soon as I ordered this package, I was, I ordered it, this came out on March 25th. I ordered this March 25th, literally 12.55 p.m. confirmation email. Quick, you know, usually that's how it goes. But the same night, I literally got the shipping email saying that the items already shipped. I'm like, and it said to check back for a tracking number. I was super excited that this literally shipped the same day that I ordered it. Uh, that's new, okay? That's new, and I'm I'm here for it, Jeffrey. I'm here for it. So let's open this up. <laughs> here we are, guys. Beauty killer two. Okay. Before we get into this. I'm gonna do a quick little update because yes, I am two weeks, maybe almost three weeks past due on my Jeffrey Skin update. I just get, I got called out. I see y'all. I'm sorry. <laughs> I am sorry, but I did use Jeffrey Skin for one week completely. Now, honestly, I noticed with my type of skin, I can't use certain products every single day when I do certain like. When I used to use Proactive, it dried me out when I did it every single morning and night type thing. And that's that was what the, that's what I had to do to get my acne clear. But it would dry me out and I didn't like it. I used something else. I'm not going to blow them up. Dried me out. Didn't like it. But with Jeffree Skin, not for nothing, guys. I did not have any bad reaction to my skin because I do have every sense of the skin. I did not have a reaction. The only product that is not my favorite that I can say that I can do without is the toner. The toner I feel like I would do every other day. I wouldn't do it every single day just because I did feel like it only dried right in this area but I think that's just the way my skin, I don't know. It Usually other stuff will dry me all up all around this area. This product definitely kept me hydrated and moisturized throughout the day. And when I tell you I felt confident, the confidence I felt without makeup, like today I did wash, Um, I did not use the cleanser. What I did use today was the moisturizer all over my face this morning. And I did use the dewy uh, morning, the morning eye dew <laughs> underneath my eyes. I do love that. Uh, I do switch it up every single day, but I love the whole, guys, the lip mask, I don't know how I, I've been living without that. That keeps your lips so hydrated. It's honestly my favorite. I love everything, but my top, top, top recommendation, if you do want something and you're not big on skincare, definitely get the lip mask. Back to Miss Mama, back to Miss Mama. This is what she looks like as soon as you open her up. So with this collection, this is a remix, okay? If you are an OG Jeffree Star Cosmetics fan, you would know Beauty Killer was his first palette that he ever dropped. He dropped this palette in 2016 when the cosmetics lines, you know, first started off, you know. And your girl got Beauty Killer right here. I'm kind of glad I didn't use her too much because Jeffrey did discontinue this palette, so if you do have Beauty Killer, you are super lucky. And so with this collection, Beauty Killer 2 is replacing Beauty Killer 1, and he is discontinuing, like I said, discontinuing Beauty Killer 1. So, this collection, he dropped a Skin Frost palette. It's been a while since he gave us a Skin Frost Pro palette. You know, he did a little something for when he did um the Heartbreaker, gave us a little Valentine's. He did, gave us a little, little, little palette, but he hasn't done a Pro palette in a while. So, that's exciting. This is the picture that I did get inside my box. Look at Miss Thang. 
am super excited. She will be up in the wall pretty. Jeffrey, Jeffrey never disappoints with packaging. Fire, everything is just always, I mean, it's ice, but it's fire. <laughs> Here's what she looks like on the outside. Super pretty, super pretty. All the colors swatched for you. And then, oh, close and close. And I hope this you guys, it's really not doing just so the first color we have is Avalanche. Then we have Snow Job. Then we have Ice Pick. Ice Pick Headache right here. Then the blue one over here is Pluto. Then we have Plow Me. Then we have this one. I oh my god, mother told me. She told me. Ash. Asphacia Frost. Something like that. Down here. That's the purple one. <laughs> Not say that name, but guys, these colors are super pigmented. Look at this. We get into the palette. There were some accessories. I don't have everything here with me today because I did two separate orders. They're coming in. I do have one of three accessories that he was giving out for this collection. Now, I'm obsessed with this mirror, okay? He dropped two different mirrors. He drops a pink version, obviously, Jeffree Classic Pink, and then he drops a more realistic version of, do you see what this is? I'm loving the window in the front of all the packaging for the mirrors, I'm loving that. He needs to keep that. <laughs> Okay, you see what's going on over here. It's a freaking guys fire. Obviously, it's going with the whole beauty killer theme, you know, killing, killing the game always. I want to say I have to say this is my favorite by far, my favorite mirror. My my top mirror was the stained glass mirror. Like, come on, Jeffrey did that, but. You're never gonna see something like this. Also drops this knife as a necklace, okay? So just imagine, it's, it's tiny, it's like this small. Um, as a little necklace, which I thought was absolutely as This is so fire, got the whole beauty killer tool theme, got the two knives right here with the JS logo, like come on, come on. This is what she looks like, guys. Beauty killer too. Now, like I said, she's getting replaced. So this is the old one. Here is the upgrade. Packaging alone killed it. You feel me? And not for nothing, this is way thinner. This is way thicker, but you're going to see the difference in the palettes now. This is the packaging of the palette. Fire. The graphics are so cool. This is what the back looks like, nothing too special, but definitely upgrade from the first beauty killer. Not to say that she's ugly, she's cute, very nice, but this is quality. And then look at the thickness. He kept the same length, but the thickness is just. With beauty killer one, I don't know if you ever noticed, but the pan size is huge, okay? Usually in a lot of palettes, you don't see such big pan size. So what he wanted to do with Beauty Killer 2 is he kept the same pan sizes, but this is her color story. This is a 10 pan palette. So these are the first five colors on the top row. So we have Gluttony Dream, Blow Up Doll, Soul Sucker, Self Expression, and Redemption. Beautiful. These are the last five colors. Now the top one is kind of, it's my skin complexion, honestly. That color is Respect. The other one is Under Oath. Indica Bling is right over here. Then we have Rebirth and then Death Row. Do you see Rebirth? Do you see, do you see these colors? Guys, I, I don't know about you, but I'm ready to just throw this on my face. So that's what we're gonna do real quick. I'm gonna play. I'm gonna do something to my face. Let's see. I'll be back.
soy like a really cool vibe i love how these colors like kind of blended together this side i'm gonna give it more of a warm vibe I don't know. Let's see. Let's play. This is fun though. I'm loving how this eye is coming out so far. I'm going to leave it alone for a little bit, work on this one, come back, put it all together. All right. Bye guys. Bye. -bye.